All right, this is a tier four raid, the first phase against Glut the Shark. The, the team, as you can see, is Baymax, Honey Lemon, Hero, Elsa, and Cobra. So Hero's main goal here is to use evasion and to speed up turns. Honey Lemon going to use the basic attack the entire time because, as you see, it puts the debuff on the shark that slows the shark down, which is so critical if you watch the shark's turns. Elsa is just there for damage. And I... Now here, there's almost no way to avoid this, that the shark puts on all these continuous damage, which will kill your characters in a couple turns. But Baymax is about the only character in the game that can do what he does right there, which is to clear, basically, all of the debuffs on the character. So now they'll survive for a long time. And now the key is just to slow the shark down. Elsa is here for damage. Everybody else here is to heal everybody and to slow the shark down. So I give the turn to Baymax because I want him to, to heal Cobra right away because there was a debuff still left from the attack. Now, this move by Cobra, you'll watch the yellow bar that's just above all the shark's tools. It, it, it speeds up. It, it, as it keeps going, once it gets to the end, it's going to be the shark's turn. That's the shark's speed meter. But every time Cobra uses that stare down, it makes the speed meter go down, and the shark's turn takes later, which is all you can really do, because eventually the shark will get you with his instant death. But if you take it longer to get his turns then you're going to be spared. Now you can see the shark is taking a turn. And this move is really hard to deal with, but there was some evasion in there which prevented some further damage because Hero was on the team. Also, you notice Bubbles almost gets killed there, and he would die with that damage that's put on him, but he has this he has the ability to clen uh, cleanse himself, which is why he's so important because he can cleanse the characters. Notice Hero had helpful immunity, which is which he was provided by Bamax, um, because they're from his from a previous move because they're both big hero six and so he wasn't hurt by the shark in, in that instance and here again here you use the cobra stare down because it brings down the shark's yellow meter that's right above all the shark's skills you can see the shark's meter is now at about zero now it's very tempting to use honey Man's powerful attack or second thing but the shark won't get stunned and it's important to keep slowing the shark down you see that little red thing the red debuff on next to the name glut the shark that's what slows him down with Honey Man, and there, Baymax's attack sometimes, as you can see, we just, for two turns now, Glot's attacks won't be as powerful. It's sometimes tough to know where to use Hero's speed up. In this case, I'm going to use it back to Cobra because Cobra is, it's very important for him to get his attacks going faster. So, he got some more damage on to, to Elsa. Now, the only time... I would want to use that the orange ball, the second attack of Honey Lemon, is, one, is when the shark gets buffs on him, be, which would be yellow underneath there, as opposed to the red, the red debuffs that are next to his name. Um, see, look how far the shark's yellow speed meter is. Now I put on the stare down, and it goes all the way down. The shark was about to have the next turn. Now all my characters have a turn before that. Now here I'm speeding up Cobra because I still don't want that. Con the key is to get all of these continuous damages and off of your characters because they will just die slowly. So I cleanse it off of Elsa. Now Baymax, his third move there that cl that cleanses everything, is a is a very important move. Now possibly I shouldn't have used it right there because I didn't actually need to clear any debuffs and it takes a little while to charge. But I used it anyway because it does give some health back to the characters. And again, when you can, it's important to shield with Hero most of the time, unless you really need to get somebody a turn to cleanse or something else. You can see right now Elsa has tactics that she got from Cobra before, which is that which is the, the little thing with the number two there. Now is the number one, and that's the most powerful move when Elsa does her ice crystals alongside with Cobra's tactics. But I usually use Cobra to cleanse, a character if they really need it, but otherwise I use his cleanse to give to Elsa because it'll also give her tactics. You can see Baymax just made Elsa the patient and took off some of that damage. So that's the key is that Baymax and Cobra are there to to help cleanse the characters. Baymax has his one move that will cleanse everybody. Cobra, as you see the stare down, it brings down the yellow. That, that time he that time it was resisted, but no, it still brought down the yellow bar. It, what was resisted is the shark cannot be silenced, but it's still really important to bring down the shark speed meter. Now, the shark speed meter is almost filled again. Now here, Cobra has this turn, and that's to cleanse any of those red continuous damages off of characters. Try to do it every time 
you can. Now here it is, the shark uses his instant kill. I have delayed this instant kill by a really long time. There's nothing I could do to prevent it from happening eventually. It, unfortunately, lose Honey Lemon, who's been slowing the characters down. Now you see that the shark has those yellow buffs. If I still had Honey Lemon, I would now use her, would have used her orange ball move to take the debuffs off the shark, because it makes the shark much more powerful. Fortunately, Cobra's move not only slows, stare down, not only slows down the shark, but it also took off one of the two buffs. And here's why Baymax is so important. All of those debuffs, there's no other way to t that I know of in this game to take off so many of those continuous damages and things at once. So that's why it's important to save that move. Again, you see that the evasion was critical right there that here how they would have been damaged quite poorly. Of course, Cobra just got continuous damage from the end of that move, which is problematic because that won't m allow him to last too many turns and he can't cleanse himself this time because I've used the move. But fortunately, Baymax has the ability to make Cobra the patient and it cleanses the move. So that's why Cobra and Baymax are so important to keeping this team healthy. Now, I made a mistake in that I gave the... I use I have the Grandma Talus spell here, but my characters actually aren't receiving enough damage for the, char for the spell to seem to charge. So I actually really could have been using an offensive spell to do more damage or something else. Elsa is just here for damage. She's a character who could be you could replace her with any character that does a lot that, that would do a lot of damage um, directly to one character. She's actually not necessarily the best one for this stage because a character who has hits that aren't hits to the entire environment work better, but Elsa is my most powerful character in any kinds of moves. So you can see again here, watch, here come the shark's speed meter is almost full bring it down with a stare down, and now I get three or four more turns before the shark comes back and gets a turn, and that's the instant deaths are not preventable, which is the only way I'm going to lose characters in this fight is from instant death if I do it properly, and it's so, or from the continuous damage if I don't get them cleansed off of characters, but that's why it's so important to take off the, the speed meter because it delays when the shark can come do his instant death. And that's why I use Elsa Physics, even though she's not known for that main attack, that is the most powerful attack, and then she can do her Ice Crystal too that I have in any of my characters. But other characters like Moana, Wasabi, characters who are... And again, watch, you see the speed meter go all the way down on the shark from the stair down. It's really a critical move to slowing the shark down. Um, but any character who does damage directly, like Stitch or somebody else, could be used in the place Elsa is. That time I used Baymax to cleanse himself since he had the damage on him. And then there I speed up Cobra, and here I'm just going to give the tactics to Elsa because nobody needs to be cleansed, and that really makes her Ice Crystal's move work better, and that's the most powerful attack I can do. It's That was 9,000, 3,000, another 6,000, so it's about 18,000 damage. Now here, this is unfortunate... <laughs> that I lose Elsa. That's a reason why you might want a tank like Baymax to be taunting more of the time, but then I would have lost Baymax, and without Baymax, as you can see, the instant death move also causes all kinds of continuous damage on everybody else, which without Baymax, I wouldn't be able to cleanse. That's why Baymax is probably the most important character here, along with Cobra, because Cobra is creating, is stopping the shark's speed meter, but Baymax is taking off all of this continuous damage, which otherwise would just end this fight very quickly. That's why this is able to last so long. And you can see Hero's usefulness there, where he, he has the evasion on all of these characters. Now, now that I've lost Elsa and Honey Lemon, I can't really do a lot of damage. So this is where I would start to consider, since I have more attempts, that I just want to get some of these characters who escape. Now, Cobra can still do some nice damage, but it's not really a ton. And Baymax is very important. So I, at this point, I really do actually want to get Baymax out of the fight. If I had done this properly, I prob might have given a chance to get Cobra out of the fight right here. But instead, I use him to slow down the shark. Um, and I'm, and the shark, well, not just yet, but eventually gets an instant death on Cobra. And here, you see all of these bites put all of this continuous damage onto Cobra. That's going to get rid of him very, very quickly. That causes a lot of damage. That's the first time the, the, the Talus spell actually charged because there's been almost no damage on me in this whole fight. So it really was kind of a waste of a spell. The Cauldron is a very important spell in this because it's giving the magic to allow all the, the moves to recharge faster that keep control over the speed of the shark. Um, and I used Cobra to heal himself. It took off some of the continuous damage, allowing him to survive. 
his defense is up, which is why he's not receiving much damage from all of those shark hits. Now here, I'm going to clear off all that continuous damage by using Bayamax's Bayamax special. I could have also tried to use the patient, but I don't think using it as a patient always cleanses all of the things quite as effectively. And see again there, the shark speed meter, that time it wasn't affected, so that was a little bit of a problem. I, um, now here the shark has some buff, and he has his instant death. Again, if you had Honey Lemon here, she could use one of her moves or if the other characters to remove the debuffs on the shark. Now that I've lost Cobra, I have basically no offense, so all I want to do is to get Bamax and Hero out of here as healthily as possible. But since now there's all this continuous damage on Bamax, I'm not going to try to escape just yet because he might not escape successfully and I can cleanse him in that, in that way. Here, I'm trying to decide whether to make Hero escape or whether to put up an evasion because the because putting up the shield might protect him. I'm not totally sure what the shark's next move is going to be, but it sort of does pay off there as he avoids getting bitten, and otherwise that would just be have been attacking Bayamax even if Hero had successfully escaped. Bayamax escapes successfully. Hero has some damage, but he also escapes successfully. Um, the damage number on this could have been much better, to be honest, but um, I lost Elsa a little early, But other than, and, and Honey Lemon. But that's how you control the shark.